Hello there, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Hadasha from Hadasha Crochet Craft. Today we are going to do this alpine pinky baby blanket. It is a very nice stitch to work with. Uh, for the yarn that I have used, I have used a Riz Cotton Gold. It is a very nice uh, yarn to work with. It has a kind of uh, velvet effect. And for the white, it is the same. It is also a Liz Cotton Gold. And for my blanket, it measures 36 by 36. Uh, and this stitch, I have used Alpine stitch. That is uh, the front post and back, a uh, normal double crochet and single crochet. So grab your yarn. Let us do a small demonstration. And for the size hook, I have used two millimeter size hook, but for today, small tutorial, we will use a 3.5 millimeter size hook. I will use a different yarn color for demonstration. So let us do it together. This is my way of creating a slip knot. So create a slip knot. And our foundation, let us create our foundation chain. For today, we will create a 12 chains that is one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten eleven twelve i think we can create more uh, that is twelve more or twelve thirteen fourteen 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20, 21, 22. That would be better, a better size. So, in your 22 chain, create two more chains. And including the 22, it will be your first double crochet. So, yarn over. Create... A double crochet for those who are new if you have no idea how to create double crochet please go to my channel and watch a video on how to create double crochets and this is how we do it create double crochet all through and I'll meet you at the end to show you what to do next. To my last double crochet, create a double crochet at the end and chain one. That chain one does not count to our next law, so now here we are going to create single crochet. How do we create single crochet? You are going to insert your hook between the two V here, between those two V. Insert your hook, yarn over. You have two, yarn over, pull through two. Again, Insert your hook between the two V's, yarn over, you have two, yarn over, two. Again, insert your hook between yarn over, two, yarn over. Those are the single crochet that we are going to create in the second row. So create all through single crochets 
or through single crochet create single crochet all through all the way and we have come to the end of our tutorial and make sure you go through the two V here to get a smooth edge like that and now we are going to chain one and turn your work now we are going to start the alpine stitch yarn over go down from your foundation double crochet here and create a front post double crochet like that let me repeat you have chained one yarn over go down skip this row of single crochet go down and create a, da a front post double crochet like that create a normal a front post double crochet and yarn over two yarn over two into this next here so we have worked behind our first single crochet here and for the next one we are going to create a normal double crochet between here so create a normal double crochet like that and into the next this one yarn over go under and create a front post double crochet just like that then into the next this one yarn over create a normal double crochet so the secret of alpine it is alternating front post and normal double crochet and these represent our down here so the next one you're going to do a front double crochet a normal double crochet a front post double a normal double crochet a front post double crochet a normal double crochet a front double a front double a normal a front double a normal double crochet work all the way like that until the end a front a normal and since it is the end of our row so also this one will put it as a normal double crochet so at the end of it you will have like that and I forget to tell you that my blanket I have chained 120 chains yeah so chain one and turn and this one does not count is our single crochet so you're going to do single crochet above this 
V's so single crochet all the way make single crochet single crochet and I'll meet you at the end to show you what to do next at the end we will create a single crochet and chain one now we have already created all the single crochet and we will alternate now our pattern so you are going to yarn over the first the first stitch here was a front post and there was a normal so where there is a front post you are going to put a normal and where there was a back post you are going to put a front, a front post double so yarn over here we are going to create a normal double crochet like that and into the next where there was normal double crochet we will create a front double crochet like that so yarn over where there was a front post i'm going to create a normal double crochet and where there was a back post a normal i'm going to create a front post double you're going to pop it outside like that so yarn over here there is a front post you create no more where there was a no more you create a front post double so continue like that Once you set the pattern, it is well presented in front of you because you'll be able to locate where there is the normal double crochet and the front double crochet. And it will be so easy for you to locate those two double crochets. So that is all you need to know about the alpine stitch and thank you so much for clicking and if you're new to my channel and you have not supported my YouTube channel please do so by hitting the subscription button and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up it will help me so much by growing my channel and until next time, bye bye.